Hey guys, Jimmy of Vegas here, and today we're playing an indie game made in Unity. And wow, already that's made me quite interested. It's called Remember to Forget. Uh, it is on Itch.io. Never played it before, first time in. Um, it just looked kind of interesting. Um, anyway, it's, um, it says it's a visual novel horror game that explores the ways that humans process past memories. It does indeed have a warning as well. It says, tackles heavier themes, life and death, imagery includes some blood and gore. This music's quite... Wow. Okay, I'm just going to get into it. I'll leave a link in the description below for you to have a go as well, if you want to. Okay, so there's some kind of chapters. Summer. World awakens as I do. Everything is always oh, nice. Wow. I actually like how this looks already. This feels... Odd. I take, take a deep breath in as my surroundings unfold around me. I feel the same sense of calm that I've grown used to. Today is no different. I think it's time I became a functional member of society. Okay. I've always wanted to travel. Okay. It's like a pretty nice day outside. The sun in England. This is England! Okay, well, this... Alright. Now I am interested. What should I wear? Oh, I assume I am a lady or identify as a lady. Um, see, I know what you guys are saying. You should you're shouting out one or the other. I'm going to go business casual. I'm literally unemployed, but who says I can't dress up like I work in an office? Okay, well that is a bit weird. Make some breakfast. Oh, okay, there we go. Right, now I get it. So does that mean you can go out the door? Yes, it does. Made out of the cave. Now for breakfast. <laughs> What's that? Crunchos. Hmm. What do we fancy? Oh. Well, to be honest, I... Oh my god, look at the cut! Look at that! Look at the mug! I just spotted that there. Right, okay, so I was going to say cereal, okay? Because I do usually eat cereal in the mornings. But I want to go coffee just because... Look at that mug. I like that mug. All I need is caffeine. Survival of the fittest. Breakfast is truly the superior meal. I say it's the most important meal of the day. How could I forget Luna? Who's Luna? I should feed her. Must be the cat. Or dog? No, must be cat, look. Okay, that's odd. Her food is still in bowl from last night. Maybe she just wasn't hungry. Do you know what? I really do like the design of this. So much effort has gone into this, it's really nice. I feel like I'm going to play this and... I, I'm starting to feel like this is probably a game that you should explore on your own rather than watch me play it. I, I'm not sure if the choices I make are going to be... relevant or different. Oh, that must be the menu, yeah. Okay, so I don't see anything here at all. Oh. Let's look out the window. That's better. This does kind of look like an English place. Oh, you can see the reflection of me there. Well, not, not me, as in me, I mean my character. You know what I mean. 
nothing ever changes much around here. I've grown comfortable with the set. Wow, okay, usually I'm not certainties. I couldn't read that then for some reason. Certainty. It says certainties. Good luck. Each day brings, okay. I'm feeling a bit special today, alright? Get off my back. Oh, I wonder who that could be. Where? I feel like a dog looking at where, 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 who's that? Somebody at the door. There's somebody at the door. Oh, hello. Sky. Okay, where's Walt? Okay. I'm fine. Um, just wondered if you wanted to hang out. I'm a little busy right now. Sorry. Oh, that's fine. Well, okay. There's the door. Wow, okay. We just gotta leave me alone. Every time I see her, she asks how I am. Well, that's what people do. Well, maybe she's worried about you. I mean, the world's an ugly place, but there are people that care out there. Picture. Did Sky drop something? The tone of this is deep already, isn't it? Relevance is there if I keep it or throw it away? I'll keep it. Okay. Feels vaguely familiar, I guess. Does it? I'll hold on to it just in case. Fine. Oh, back. That's it. Okay. I tell you what, a lot of effort has gone into this. Like, uh, just, I can tell an immense amount of effort. So it kind of reminds me in some ways, um, you know, like the Telltale series that we used to do. My favourite of that was the uh, Tales from the Borderlands one. I actually really like that. So it, obviously it's that kind of style in some ways, except this is a bit more simplistic. But the art style of this is absolutely gorgeous. Just really nice. Acceptable daytime bed. Should I watch something? Yeah, what should we watch? Ooh. Rewatch The Office for the 80th time. Nostalgic childhood movie marathon that makes me feel 12 years old. Okay, so I'm going to be controversial here. I don't like The Office, neither the English or the American version of it. I don't like the English one because I don't like Ricky Gervais. And because I don't like Ricky Gervais or The Office, the English one, I just have no desire to watch the American one, so I've never seen it. So let's go with Nostalgic Childhood Movie Marathon. Quite the drug. Well, nostalgia is, to be honest. Just, yeah. I'm not sure if it's me, but that looks a bit sadder than it did before. Okay, the tone is really making me feel like it's, it's very deep. Let's lock the outside world well out. Well, there are lots of things in this bleak world, it's not close to each other. 
See what it means, tackles heavier themes, life and death. It's that time of year again, folks. Okay. So, okay, right. So I've, I'm have i going to make a decision now. I'm going to leave it there. Um, I'm going to play this on my own um, off um, video, just because I want to carry on on my own here. Um, and if you guys do want to play it, I think it's best if you do play it if you're into that kind of thing rather than watch me play it because the, the choices might make something different um honestly i quite enjoyed that um, i mean I, it's not very often i get incredibly serious but i feel like the, the tone of this is deep it, it's really deep and it will stop and make you think um it might also help some people who maybe genuinely feel disconnected from the world um, yeah so like i say i'll leave a link to it in the description below if, if you like this give it a thumbs up if you didn't give it a thumbs down but let me know in the comments why you give it a thumbs down why you didn't like it uh, i'm sorry for getting so well deep it's just, it's just not what we really see much of on this channel is it we, we, we're developers we're not supposed to feel <laughs> well i suppose everyone's allowed to feel that aren't they so yeah, um, okay, that was Remember to Forget, I've been Jimmy Vegas, and honestly, thank you so much for actually watching this, if you watched from uh, the start, I really appreciate it guys, um, yeah, I will see you around, thank you very much for watching.